looking for cheap, fast, and reliable Madden Ultimate Coins, look no further than my sponsor, Mutt Reserve. Head on over to MuttReserve.com. Use code Poodle at checkout for 30% off your order. Take advantage, guys. Do not waste your money on packs. Skip the packs. Head on over. Pick up some coins. Enjoy. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And first and foremost, guys, today we're going to be going over the upcoming Mutt content in the game. I'm doing this on a Saturday for a specific reason. I'll get into that in a little bit, guys. But first and foremost, I'm back from vacation. It was great. Thank you guys for asking. Um, many of you guys may not even know that I was gone. I mean, I had videos recorded, right? I, I, I had a plan. It went, it went well. The vacation was great. I may even look a little bit tanner. I'm peeling to another oblivion right now. Uh, got food poisoning during the vacation. Got very, very sick for a little bit, actually. Uh, food poisoning and some poisoning at the same time was not, was not, was not fun. Um, honestly... You guys know I had COVID as well a while back. Uh, this was way worse than COVID, the way I felt. But I recovered from that pretty fast and went back to the trip, obviously. But point being is, it was a long trip. It was like 10 days just about. But I've been gone. I'm back now. I'm ready to go back to get into my recording schedule. It feels great, guys. Uh, but yeah, that's about it. I mean, I think I covered it up to the basis. So if you guys are new, though, and you're here, just make sure to subscribe. Turn that on to boys. Come join the family. Always smash that like button and comment down below. Doing those two things helps with the channel tremendously. So make sure you guys are always doing that. Yeah, it's better for that. Let's head on over to this. Let's go check out some of the stuff for the upcoming week. So, guys, as of Monday, starting today, not gonna be uh, not gonna be too much, considering you know it's a Monday, typical run of the mill sort of stuff. And then in terms of now Tuesday, right? This could be potentially a big week. So Tuesday, again, is when we're gonna be hoping. We're hoping, we're hoping for some Wednesdays. What we're really hoping for here, Wednesday is what I'm hoping for. Now, I'm hoping for power ups. While Crow Wednesday keeps giving us the same, you know, repeat crap over and over again, I'm hoping for a, um, a power up drop because there's a lot of players that really, really, really could do some great damage in Mutt if they had a power up, right? Or I'm hoping they prep us, right? So one thing that they did a while back, if you don't remember, they gave us some power ups and it, and it turned out that those guys got cards in the next promo. So I'm hoping for the combine promo, they know a few guys who will be super fast, like let's say John Ross, who needs a power up. So they know they're gonna give us a 98 speed John Ross, maybe drop, give him a power up now, right? That would be cool. I, I, I could hope for that, but power-ups would definitely be a cool drop. We, we've been waiting for power-ups. And honestly, for wildcard ones, they should use it as an opportunity to give power-ups more so than the other stuff. I know a lot of people would appreciate the power-ups more than they probably appreciate anything else, to be honest, because power-ups are huge. They're important to this game. They're a staple in, in, in the foundation of Madden 21. And, it's, you know, Madden 20 as well. They've, it's been a staple, so I, I really hope they go ahead and give us some power-ups. I don't know what else is left in the rotation. Like we got in the flashbacks, the rising stars, the heavyweights, the veterans. I feel like we went through all that, so I think it's about time for another uh, power up, or maybe make it fun, right? Give it, they 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 could have used Wildcard Wednesday for some fun stuff as well, like drop an additional two Ultimate Legends, drop a uh, an early Combine LTD because it's Wildcard Wednesday. It'd be cool if they would implement like some other cool features with Wildcard Wednesday instead of the run of the mill uh, rotation they have going. But that that's about how that works, guys. Now going to Thursday. LTDs as per usual. Now, LTDs, as per the last drop, guys, they are now 97 overalls, which is absolutely insane. Like, these cards are great. Powered up. They can get they can get powered up to 98, guys. These are the top cards in the game. Layden Vander Esch, 93 speed powered up would be great. Corlin Sutton, 95 speed powered up. Good. And that's and those are te technically two bad cards for Mud, right? You're getting a linebacker, which people don't care about, and a wide receiver. Uh, that's usually on the slower side, Corlin Sutton. So just wait till we get some better, guys. We could see some insane cards out of this LTD slot coming up this week. Uh, I don't know exactly who would drop where, but let's just say, right? Let's say they gave Saquon one. Now, if you remember, Saquon got one earlier in the year, but he, is, he was hurt, so maybe they'll give him another one, right? I don't, I doubt it. But let's say they did. Saquon would be an insane running back out of that spot. A few guys, right, would be insane out of that spot. These new 97 LTDs are going to be completely end game, uh, top tier cards. So I really hope they give some, you know, give, give give some due to some great cards. I don't know who would be really left that we could be like, okay, that's a card that would be great. But I'm hoping we get something good. Point is here, guys, there's potential for anyone and any card to be a great drop. And that's what I love about this, uh, the LTD promo all year. At any moment, you can get a great card. Like I said, Brandon Linder, great center. You know, it's not that you want him, but he's great. Jerome Baker for used linebackers, that would have been a great card. Uh, Terry McLaurin was a meta card. Jerry Sneed was a meta card. Um, Anthony Costanza was good. Byron Jones was pretty good as well. Nick Bosa was pretty good. Um, Tyler Gorilla was actually pretty bad. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Shaquille Griffin, great speed, great zone. You know, there's just a lot of potential in any card that gets dropped. So I've really, I've really enjoyed uh, this year with LTDs. So hopefully we get some other ones. I don't know. Again, it's hard to predict them. They could literally be anyone. They could be anyone on the team. There's really no rhyme or reason to who gets what, quite honestly. 
um but it would be cool to see to see a banger name pretty soon i don't know who like i said who could be a good idea maybe guys who were injured like an odell kind of kind of card but again he got a card not too long ago and he may get a combine card so we have to wait and see on that but moving on from there guys next we do have the nfl combine promo which is a decent chance so today's the 22nd so as of let's see uh tuesday will be the 23rd 24th will be wednesday 25th 26th 27th 28th so last year guys on february 28th we did receive the nfl combine promo and february 28th this year lands on sunday so there's a chance we see it i don't think we'll see it sunday i think we'll see it probably monday but maybe the reveal on sunday so that'd be pretty cool as well i hope we do end up getting the combine promo pretty soon like I said, the combine promo is one of the most fun promos of the year in terms of the players you get. Not, it's not the promo itself isn't going to be you know crazy immersive like the zero chill promo. But the NFL combine promo is good for two things. First, it's based off the combine, which just means that you're going to get and it's all athleticism, right? It's four cone, you know, forty yard dash. So you're going to be getting all these guys who are athletic freaks. So pretty much in Madden right now, right? What do people care about? Are the athletic freaks right that's that comes first for even stats so you're gonna get 99 speed guys you're gonna get 99 jumping guys 99 agility guys 99 uh, elusiveness guys you're gonna get guys like that which is super super cool so you got again jalen ramsey Deion sanders john ross alvin kamara typically you get guys like vernon davis odell beckham jr um you get you get a bunch of guys point is every promo there's like let's say every promo gets 20 guys there's always those two guys, right? Like that Denzel Ward or that, that guy that's like fast. And you're like, okay, those are the cards we care about. This promo essentially is a whole promo worth of guys that are that guy. Suppo supposed to be the top guys at least. And then it gets a lot of, and a lot of good budget players, right? Because you're going to get guys like Montez Sweat, 93. With a 92 speeded outside linebacker as a pass rusher. You're going to get a bunch of budget guys with good speed or good stuff because all these cards will have speed. And a lot of them will be cheaper if they're just set cards, like these lower ones. So, again, it's not going to be super immersive with the... The animation you guys never saw that the combine animation for the packs may be the coolest animation that mud has ever had for packs if you guys haven't seen it, you need to go check that out on twitter under mud leaks i also made a video on it if you want to go back and find that but uh pretty much it was so cool right when the pack opens it, it changes to the animation of a, fo a football combine and the 40 yard dash like the, with the, the lightning behind it whatever it was something like that it was super cool guys you have to go see the animation but common promo is going to be cool I'm going to drop some of the most fun and f fun players all year Again, I don't know who they'll drop. It could be anyone. Again, if there's a combine every year. There's been so many guys. Like I said, some staples are Odell, some Chris Johnson, um, Deion Sanders. Deion Sanders has been a staple of the combine promo forever. I'm hoping they do reintroduce Leon Sandcastle. You don't know Leon Sandcastle is like the meme. The meme of Deion Sanders is like alter ego. You know, like that. Uh, not alter ego, but you guys know what I mean. That they created for. They do. They did commercials with it a few times for the combine. They've uh, had a muck card. Now, Leon Sandcastle is insane. He can play any position in the past. So there's been years where he can literally play any position on the field, quarterback, running back, wide receiver. I hope we get a Leon Sandcastle again. That would be definitely fun. That would definitely sell some packs. If you want to make an LTD, it would be, I don't really care. It would just be cool to have him in the game. But yeah, I mean, again, I, it may be a special stream Sunday. I don't think we maybe get the promo this week because everything's been a little bit behind. But I'm hoping that we do see it pretty soon. And then, guys, finally, we have Ultimate Legends coming. So, so far, these are the Ultimate Legends that we do have. We have Derek Thomas, Jim Thorpe, Antonio Cromartie. And it's pretty cool that all these cards all have different card art. I like that. I really like that. Corey Dillon, Travis Frederick. We have Isaac Bruce. We have Adelius Thomas, Harry Carson, Minjo Green, Steve Hutchinson, Randall Cunningham, Brian Dawkins, and, Ma and Namdu Asamoah. Asamoaga, uh, however you say it. Point is, Ultimate Legends are nice. They're good. And we have some pretty cool names already, right? So, uh, Anamdi is one of the guys that we haven't had. Like, in years past, I feel like we were lacking him for a little bit. Um, ha Harry Carson's a new one to me. Adelius Thomas is one of the newer ones this year. Corey Dillon came out last year, and we have him again this year, which is super cool. Derek Thomas is back again with an upgrade. So, there's some really cool names, and it's just a start, guys. There's so many more to come. We still have the Vicks, the Dion's, the Moss, Emmett Smith, and a few other guys. Now, again, Emmett Smith's not going to be game-breaking, but just a big name in terms of uh, football. But yeah, that's about it, guys. That pretty much wraps up the video. Ultimate Legend, I don't know who this week's drop will be. Gonna be cool, though, guys. We have plenty of good ones already. I mean, these cards are great. And remember, they're gonna be 98 overalls. Not this week, but eventually they'll be 98 overalls. So that'll be the powered up 99s. And then, of course, you know, we're gonna get, we'll probably be at full blown 99s by, well, powered up 99s. We probably get right around the, right around the combine promo. So give it another maybe two weeks, two, three weeks. But like end of March, we're probably we're probably going in full head of steam. End of March, April is right there. We're probably going full 99s the rest of the year for almost every card uh, in terms of power to plus, right? But yeah, guys, pretty much wraps up today's video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you're new to the channel, give this video a big thumbs up. And always subscribe and comment, guys. Doing those things help out the channel tremendously. 
let's keep growing thank you guys comment down below let me know what you guys think of the uh you know for the combat promo who's your predicted master do you know who leon sandcastle is that's about it if you guys need coins head over to mutt reserve down below and use code poodle at checkout for a discount that's about it enjoy the rest of your day i'm out peace